Uh, ano ba? I think the easiest, uh, the easiest way for me is to communicate what the film really is about. It's, uh, it revolves around the very millennial concept of ghosting. So, for those of you who don't know what ghosting is, you know, but when you're seeing someone, you're dating someone, or even when you're in, already in a relationship with someone and then out of the blue they just disappear. Um, so it's a you know with, with the millennials it's a very they're everyone's pretty much uh, familiar with the concept what happens when the ghost the one who disappeared uh, resurfaces and then is uh, forced to resolve whatever issues he left behind when he ghosted everyone because uh, my, my character's name uh, is Gab, and he's the one who ghosted not just his boyfriend, also his friends. Uh, he was gone for a year, he comes back. Tapos, paano pa nga ba naman, ano, pwedeng maging exciting ang pag -re resurface uh, other than pag-attend ng isang high school reunion. So, ayun, eh, yung uh, boyfriend pa niya, his ex-boyfriend, is part of his high school reunion. So, in one event, nagarap-arap sila, tapos, ayun, um, maayos ba? Na are um, apologies necessary, even necessary? Is there something to be sorry about or wala? So, maganon, ganon yung mga uh, topics basically na pinaiikutan pina yung pelikula. So, ano yung mga ginawa mong preparation for your character? Um, no, sige. Because I got this script, I think, uh, about two months before we started filming. Uh, prior to us uh, starting with the production, we had a lot of back and forth, back and forth. Because I wasn't sure if I was going to get it. I was like, I'm So, But I, when I got the script, I read through it um, three or four times over and over. Uh, because a lot of the, the scenario, kasi, a lot of the things that happens to my character are and I say na they happen exactly the same way in my personal life. Pero I guess yun yung naging proseso ko. Parang how similar am I uh, as G to the character? And, um, Anong part yung pwede kong mapasok yung personal experience ko and how it has affected me? Mm -hmm. And what part did I play in, 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 in that event? Tapos... Uh, so, dumami na kami. Yeah. Pero gano'n, tapusin ko muna yung sagot ko. Okay. Uh, so, gano'n. Uh, dahil nga, I had more than enough time to really study and uh, to, to study the script. Uh, Ayun, parang nung nag-reading na kami, may, 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 may dala na rin ako that there, there were things na may iba ako na ako na input when we discuss the script and then um, how our director wanted to treat the film and how, what was his treatment for it. So, yeah. Hmm. Yun. Um, um, for direct, um, paano mo um, inumpisahan yung project na ito? Ito uh, sila sila. Well, uh, Sila Sila started out three years ago. Um, si Daniel Sanyana, yung writer ng film, um, um, nag-internship siya under me. And around that time, parang wala talaga akong clear na projects na film production related. So parang feeling ko, parang weird na magkaroon ng apprentice or internship. So sabi ko, ano, magsulat ka na lang tapos tuturuan kita magsulat. So initially he wrote a short film um, about gang relationships sa isang ano, uh, high school homecoming. Ganyan. Tapos sabi ko, parang mas maganda siyang gawing feature film. Uh, he's very ano, reluctant to do it. Pero parang napilit na. Napilit na siya. <laughs> uh, and then, last year, dapat nasa Q Cinema. Yung, ano, we, we were one of the finalists uh, no una kan announce in Q Cinema, but uh, maraming personal and logistical concerns na 
naging problema. And and Daniel was so frustrated about it. So parang ito, nung nagkaroon ng chance sa piso, parang piso ko, kailangan talaga namin gawin. Parang, so ganun siya nagsimula. Uh, uh, tungkol talaga siya sa ano, excess na iniiwasan yung isa't isa pero hindi nila matakasan kasi para-para sila ng kayo. So, dun talaga nagsimula yung yung kayo. Um, ayun. <laughs> Yan, how will you uh, differentiate tong third film mo dun sa past uh, two films na nagawa? <laughs> <laughs> well, I think, ano, parang may feeling ako na every film that you make is a corrective. Okay. Parang kahit yung mga sinusulat ko in between na hindi din direct parang I try to learn from ano. So parang feeling ko ito um, is me trying to uh, correct those previous mistakes. But also at the same time, dun sa previous two films, uh, laging merong LGBT characters sa background. Uh, so parang dun sa ano, Martin Del Rosario and San Dino Martin sa Dagita. Tapos, nandun si um, Paolo Paraiso with Miguel Valdez. Tapos, um, Shelo Aquino with Tina Filet, na LGBT characters dun sa background, dun sa pack. Uh, ito yung parang, ano, dati kasi inisip ko, parang bakla ka na, gagawa ka pa ba ng ano, kwenta tungkol sa bakla. Uh, pero ngayon inisip ko, why not? Eh, eh bakla ako eh, kailangan kong yun ito. So, yun yung, yun yung, yun yung una, parang front and center ngayon yung, ano, uh, gay characters in the film. So, iniwasan ko siya, baka takot din ako kung gawin siya. Pero, well, ngayon, hinarap ko na siya. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, yeah. In terms of directing, para bang na mas naging relax ka or ano yung difference nung na, dito sa for this film? Well, I think as you grow, ano, parang may certain relaxed qualities naman. But at the same time, mas malaki yung pressure kasi ito yung pinakamaikling number of shooting days namin uh, from being so spoiled sa Dagita mo. Philippine shooting days ito. And it's struggle. <laughs> um, and, and it's uh, kaya na natin yun. <laughs> Tapos, <coughs> and it's the first time na hindi ako nagsulat because Daniel yeah, yeah. wrote it. But I mean, I wrote it with him but siya talaga. It's first time ko to produce it myself. Uh, still with friends pero parang ngayon uh, yun. So, yung mga ganun concerns, parang iba pala talaga siya. Uh, I guess more relaxed kasi um, kasi tungkol, tung, parang alam na alam ko siya ngayon. Parang dati tungkol sa matatanda middle age characters or super tatandang characters sa sa paki. Ngayon, age ko. Ganyan. <laughs> oh, wala pang ano? Late 20 <laughs> Kahit na lang 30 na ako din. <laughs> wala pang parang ano, pressure kasi di ba yung two previous films mo award winning. So, parang <laughs> parang hindi naman yun yung ano, inisip pag gumagawa ka ng film. Parang hindi ko yung awards laging bono siya. Parang ang hirap kapag ano, kapag din ang target mo yun. Parang hindi ko laging dun ka sa kung ano yung gusto mong ikwento at that particular time. And ngayon, sobra kong ready mo for this. And parang more than anything, parang yung kaba ko ay kung, kung magagawaan ko ng justice na gumawa ng kilig film after gumawa ng parang very parang morose tungkol sa mga tao parang nagkakarang midlife or like late in life crisis. Okay. Ngayon, parang kilig film. Thank you, Derek. How about you, uh, Topher? Uh, can you tell something about your character? Okay, for start, Topper. Topper. Ako na. Oh, kasi I feel for you. It's also J. You know, it's J. Topper. Okay. Um. Yeah. Uh. Jared, you know, one half of the relationship. I am a ghosted party. Um. Basically. Uh. Yun. Uh. Is it a Jared? No. Parang, um, he's a Virgo. <laughs> he's a Virgo. So, parang, uh, he's more, uh, kung medyo makalat si Gab, no? Slight. Slight lang. Um, he's the one who's just more steadfast and more, more, ano, uh, oh, parang more sure. So, but, yung character mo ba dito, parang, um, same kayo ng, parang kayong, parang top? Ano? <laughs> are you or, 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 or Versa or parang wala naman <laughs> no, <laughs> or parang wala naman distinction ano naman eh hello 
can you really tell by the way a person looks kung top siya or bottom? So, I mean, at the end of the day, kung anong masarap doon ka, yun lang naman yun eh. Diba? You don't, not all tough gay guys, uh, not all are, tough people are, are tops. Oh, oh, diba? So, uh, no, pero, I think, diba, parang I think you will also be surprised uh, by different, diba, gay relationships is not necessarily top bottom. Oh, yeah. not, diba? I mean, that's the whole point, diba? It's not necessarily, as in yung lalaki doon, which is so like, diba? So many years ago, we <laughs> really think yeah. about it. It's just they're two, they're two, um, they're two guys, and mm-hmm. they both have their own identities, and they're well, they both love each other and hate each other and love each other and hate each other. Siguro mas magandang um, tiningnan dito sa movie is like, and hopefully when the viewers watch it, it's it's not distinguishing ah sino kaya yung top, yes, sino yung bottom. Uh-huh. It's really more in the relationship who has who has the upper hand. Sino yeah. ba yung uh, being in that relationship, sino yung, yung domin, may dominance yes. in terms of emotional power. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Parang, sino yung habol ng habol, sino yung puro na lang pahabol. Yeah. Pero gets ko na kasi, kasi I mean, natin, yung, but I get naman how to define a You want something and you wanna, like, <laughs> yeah. you wanna define them ka agad. Yeah. But honestly, I think it's why I like, yung, I like the film kasi they, it's not defined. They're just who they are. It's a relationship. Mm-hmm. So parang, there's no hindi siya clear cut na diba it's siya yung top siya yung bottom siya yung whatever okay and the same verse okay um 